Jed here to demonstrate how to create and manage a one-time meeting in GoTo with the desktop app or web experience. To complete this task, you'll need a valid GoToConnect or GoToMeeting account. I'll also show you how to use the Instant Meeting feature, which can be used with the desktop app or web experience. I'll use the desktop app for this video, but GoTo can be accessed to this site. I've already signed in as the user Ryan Noble. You'll see different icons here depending on which GoTo solutions are available with your plan. Click the Meetings icon. Let's start with creating a meeting with a specific date and time. Click the Create button at the top of the screen. Begin by giving the meeting a title. Select One Time Meeting. Now specify the date, time, and duration of your meeting. Note that it is okay for you to start and end the meeting outside of this time frame. GoTo will not end the meeting for you. If you need to change the invitation time zone, click here. With regards to adding co-organizers, click this button to do so. Then search for the desired person from your team. Even though I won't go into many details in this video, you can click on more options to see additional settings available for customizing your meeting. Such as requiring a meeting password and enabling breakout rooms. The Personalize Your Meeting section is optional. You can choose to add a custom start page and personalize the meeting link. If desired, you can select different themes from a drop-down list. Even though we won't be doing it in this video, we recommend personalizing the meeting link because it is easier to remember than a 9-digit meeting ID. Click the Save button once you're done. You are then taken to the Meeting Details page. If you are within 15 minutes of the scheduled start time, you'll see the Start This Meeting button over the name of the meeting. Clicking that would begin the meeting. Even though the new meeting is not scheduled to begin in over 15 minutes in this case, I could start the event if I wanted to by clicking this button. If you want to invite others to the meeting, click the clipboard icons in two different locations to copy the information you see. You can send an invitation to another person through email or chat. Notice the icons in the top right corner. Those will only appear if you are the organizer or co-organizer of the meeting. You can edit the meeting details or even delete the meeting if needed. Clicking the Add to Calendar button allows you to add this meeting to your desktop, Outlook, or Google Calendar. You are not required to have your GoTo account synced with a calendar for this to work. You can also click here to download an ICS file. Opening that file will allow for the event to be added to your respective calendar. Finally, let me show you how to use the Instant Meeting option. Sometimes you want to start a meeting instantly without scheduling one in advance or using a reusable room link. Click the arrow to the right of the Create button. Then click Instant Meeting. You can see that I'm immediately taken to the Meeting Preview window. From here I can select my video and audio options before I join a meeting. I've officially started a meeting. Click the Session Info button in the top left corner. If you want others to join the meeting, here's the information you'll want to share. That's all there is to create and manage a one-time go-to meeting with the desktop app or web experience.